here, let's just talk about this real quick. Because I think, you know, it, it deserves... Every year we see innovation from just chatting streamers as they push boundaries and ask the question, how can we do even less? Presenting the award for best just chatting streamer brought to us by Twitch is Agent Zero. I'm not going to lie. When I saw Agent Zero pull up, I was like, oh, dude, I lost for sure. Which I was like, I already, I already suspected I was not going to win. This is the stat category for sure. Just chatting. From cooking. Also, it was kind of cooked. Agent Zero gave you the award. Wait, why? I mean, I guess it's the same reason why I thought I was going to lose. To awkwardly sitting there beside rappers. These, these content creators, man, they know how to entertain their audience no matter the day. So let's get to the nominees for Just Chatting. First up, we got Iron Mouse. Pay Money Wubby. Your Rage Gaming. Hassan Abi. That was because I made that face because Ludwig was booing for me right next to me. He's like, boo, you suck. You're the only streamer actually reading chat, so you did deserve that award. No, all these other streamers do it too. They and the winner is... Stuff. Hassan Abi. It's not even a joke. I was legit... Haters went wild and moist chat after you won. I, I was legit shocked. Like, I, I, I thought it was going to be rage. I, I was genuinely, genuinely not. Um, I was genuinely not thinking I was going to win, uh, like, at all. <sighs> Haters were moist, bro. They were dripping. Yeah, whatever. Rage Twitter was so cold after it, this. It sucks. They were saying how it was straight up rigged. Will we ever come back from the big lie? I I don't think so. I think Rage's community is literally out of uh, out of all the other communities is the one community that you know some people are of course going to be like oh l uh, that sucks whatever but like they lit that is one fucking community that straight up was like well you know Hassan is one of the big dogs like uh you know he he kind of deserved it uh, whatever that kind of thing. Um, yeah, I, I, trust me, there is, because, because Rage likes me, I like Rage, so, and, and there's a, we have a, we have a, you know, overlap of audience members, so I think you guys, like, see the haters, but I guess I have a different perspective on the haters in general, um, I have a, I have a different perspective on the haters in general, because, like, I see how aggressive some haters can be, and as far as, like, um, yeah, as far as like, uh, people hating, uh, I would say it's understandable that people get like upset. Uh, it's understandable that people get upset when their favorite streamer doesn't win an award. Right. But like, uh, out of uh, all of that, like, I think Rage's community was literally, um, uh, was, was literally the most understanding that I've seen. I was in Rage's Discord last night. Most of the talk was just people saying he'll get back. He'll get you back on the basketball court. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Like, you know. Why are we talking about haters right now? Like, this is a positive moment. Yeah. Uh, I, I actually didn't think I was going to win this because I lost a misgift last year. So I was like, it's over, you know what I mean? After that, it's like, I'm definitely gonna lose again. Um, but um, I wanna thank my community. It is very strange that uh, I'm in a gamer space 
uh, with a lot of other incredible content creators, especially those who were, uh, you know, put up for this award tonight. Um, and I did not prepare a speech at all. I didn't think I was going to win. So I was just like, like, I, I literally didn't even contemplate for a brief moment that I was going to win. So I just did not even prepare for a speech. The fact that a political content creator could be, uh, you know, riding with the top dogs in this field. King Leopold. Is Vlad something that I two never personally imagined Dia would ever happen. Like, I, I literally feel like this is an accident. That fourth. Have gotten to the point that Thank you for the 50 gifted subs. God damn. You just talk on what you feel in the moment. It's all good. Like, my only discernible skill is chatting. Chatting that at the top of the hour, there's a three-minute ad break. And that if you no longer want to see those ads, all you need to do is subscribe which you can do for $5 or for free with a Twitch Prime. Okay, yeah, paywalling the acceptance speech, pretty much. Mama2210, thank you for the 10 gifted subs, allowing 10 people to no longer see the ads. Guapoco, thank you for the 5 gifted subs, allowing 5 people to no longer see the ads. A totaling 65 people. Sexy Panda Bear with 100, 165 people. If you haven't gotten a gift to sub at this point, you're not getting one. Let's be real, okay? Here's the three-minute ad break now. You can make your own luck by subscribing for $5 or free with a Twitch Prime. Here's the three-minute ad break now. Uh, not Jackie, thank you for the five, get the subs. Adekino, thank you for the five, get the subs. Sakura Gore, thank you for the 25 gift to subs. I've my career. So I'm endlessly I'm gonna run it thankful back. and grateful for my community. Personally, imagine would ever happen. Like I, I literally feel like this is an accident that I have gotten to the point that I've gotten to in my career. So I'm Phantom Pirate. Thank you for the and grateful for my community. Five gifted subs. And um, yeah, your rage gaming. Uh, you're gonna have to one v one me in basketball now for sure. Like, I mean, you're not gonna let someone who defeated you now also talk shit up here, right? No, I'm kidding. He, he, your, your rage. You're incredible. You had a wonderful year. I really thought you were going to win, to be honest. Uh, Wubby, you're great. Everyone else, I mean, Ira Mouse is great. She already won an award, so, like, you don't need extra. You know what I mean? And, um... Geo yeah, Forio, thank you for the five. You know, thank you so much. Seriously. I feel like a lot of streamers felt like they weren't going to win. People were so people were mad when you when you said that. Yeah, I mean, I was talking shit because you know I I wanna I wanna keep it going. You know what I mean? I wanna keep the rivalry going. Chatters and Moise got so mad at that call out. Unironically, it's funny that Chatters and Moise community got mad, but like that was to keep content going between me and Rage. And also simultaneously, like, uh, you know, that I was feeding uh, Rage's uh, community, which they like. They liked it. They appreciated it. So, like, I don't really care what Moise's chat was saying or whatever other chats were saying. Yeah. Also, remember, guys, Coco uh, XXO ASMR, thank you for the 10 of the subs. Remember, people were yelling at Kai Day winning Valorant streamer. You know what I mean? Like, at that point, if you're yelling about Kai Day, who is like never done anything wrong, just a, a huge uh, positive force in the community, who also, on top of that, just came out with a, a cancer diagnosis, like, if you're yelling at Kaide winning a fucking award after all that, then, yeah, of course people are going to yell at me. You know what I mean? Like, that's it. Didn't they vote before uh, her diagnosis? Yeah, exactly. Kaide responded last night after winning Best Valorant Streamer at the Streamer Awards saying she didn't, she knew how much hate she'd get when she lost, uh, when she won and Tarek didn't. She's a great streamer. Charlie wanted to invite Rage to ball at the Moist Court. Yeah, we're we're gonna do that for sure. I just noticed the bow tie was a little crooked. Yeah, I know. That's how you know I didn't even fucking think I was gonna win.
Anyway. It was a crowd choice award. I know people were mad that like, you know, more people voted for Kaide is crazy. Like I, I, like I said, Tadek is my brother. I love him. I love him to death. I voted for him like literally, but, um, ultimately, you know, uh, I, I, we like everybody, you know what I mean? It's just like so weird. Um, oh wait, actually I voted for, I, oh, I did. I, uh, wait. Yeah. I voted for Kaide for Valo. Never mind. I didn't, I voted for Tadek for gamer of the year. Will's loss was the only one I was sad about. Yeah, me too. I also send death threats to people who win the Oscar over my favorite actor. Yeah. Staff is too powerful. The way she's walking is so funny and healed. <coughs> <coughs> Jesus Christ, dude. I lo okay, that was perfect. Uh, I got to run that back. That's that's too good. That's, li that's way too good. Daphne looking like looking at Lug like he's about to call him a white slur. Oh well, yeah, you know. Oh yeah, that's funny. Yeah, you're right. I forgot about how much of an anti-white, anti-white racist she is. Oh, that's funny. mean azan i was i'm bow-legged and i can't straighten my legs and heels <laughs> i don't fucking know how to walk in stilettos which me luck yeah how was hanging out with jerma everything involving him in the war show is wholesome as fuck yeah jerma is a legend dude i mean he is uh worthy of the praise he is worthy of all the praise he gets. If anything, he is underrated. You know what I mean? Um, did you kiss him? I did not. It's funny because like he's so insanely normal in real life. It's like very odd. And then but also so incredibly creative that like he's like like if 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 you didn't know who Jerma was and you saw him like walking down the street you would literally not think twice you'd be like that's a just a normal guy like he is he doesn't have the stand user uh, energy that like a lot of streamers have uh cuz people like myself uh you know we're desperate for 
uh, constant attention, nonstop. You know what I mean? I go so far as to even Ludwig, you know, we, we love that. Uh, no matter what we say, we do like that. We like to be, uh, we like to be a little weird. Uh, we, but Germa, on the other hand, is, is so gifted, so creative, and so different with his like actual uh, on camera performance than how he is in real life, where he's just such a wholesome, humble, normal guy. Did you get emotional at any of the rewinds or the awards? Yes. Um, Yeah, I, uh, I got, I got emotional during the Germa award and, uh, the, the, you know, Germa recognition and also almost cried during, uh, Morgan. Like I teared up, but I, but I held it back. I'm strong. I'm a big, strong boy. I held back my tears, you know? So if anybody says like, Hassan, I saw you tearing up, uh, I'll just tell them, you know, uh, I'll tell everybody that that's a lie. You have no proof. So sucks to suck. Bro, this shit is hilarious. Oh yeah, we we already covered hey, this. We we watched this earlier. Um, 